everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. The prize. We're going to take up my number six, six star to rank four. And we just got done with the Act 8.1 full exploration. And although I was afraid I was going to get a Mystic rank three to four gem, because I already have three, I think three mystics at rank four. See, Doom, Claire, and Diablo. Uh, we didn't get a mystic. We actually got a mutant. So now, among the mutants, and I uh, showed this on stream, there's really only two mutants that I have to choose from. Apocalypse and Kitty Pride. Both of them I like. I use both of them about the same amount. You know, these are tools and I use them when I see that they would be best used. I'm not the best at either of them, but it is what it is. So surprise, surprise, I'm going to be putting out this video same day so you guys can take a look and see who I chose. There's a level up going on right now, and I'm not going to wait for the advancement because as Ghost Dog said, I long outgrew that. Uh, now, if they ever up the rewards, then maybe I'll start doing it again. All right. But anyway, if you think you can guess which one, Apocalypse or Kitty Pride, that I chose to take up to rank four, leave a comment. I'll wait. But we're about to reveal it in five, four, three. Two, one, Kitty Pride. Now, I'm not the best at her, but here we go. And it's done. Kitty Pride is my latest number six rank four champion. And she'll probably change my prestige. Let me look here before we uh, take her all the way up. So my prestige right now is 15, 101. Uh, I don't know if she will or not. Um, she's like 130 sig, and I'll probably max her out at some point in time. Um, but no need to rush it right now. But yeah, I'm not the best at Kitty by any means. I'm, I'm a little bit better uh, than I was, and I do plan on you know continuing to use her, like I said, because uh, she is fun. And she's worth learning to use. Uh, on the stream, when I was showing them that I had either Kitty or Apoc, Bad Boy, who is a Kitty lover, was of course screaming Kitty, Kitty. Um, and I and I read the chat, and a lot of people were like, um, Apoc is good at rank three, but Kitty can really benefit from, you know, the larger health that she gets and things like that. And so I was like, okay, I can see that. So her, yeah, 133, there we go. Her SIG level is 133. And I have enough SIG stones. I have 187 plus, what, 55. Um, so I can easily take her up with just the ones I have in my overflow. Um, so we may do that, um, maybe during, a. uh, let me see, is there an item use on right now? I think we just, uh, got finished with our item use. Yeah. So maybe when the next item use comes on, maybe we'll see. Let me see. Aha. She did change my prestige from 101 to 246. So my prestige went up a little bit. Nice. Nice. All right. Let's, uh take her into realm of legends now i did one on her before yeah, let's get on here and i'm always going to bring her with tigra that's just I i'm just going to do it that synergy for me is like the best and she has a uh, where is she there she is she has a synergy with Ghost. 
as well. So I could have the ghost uh, trinity here plus Kitty and Tiger. And every champion on that team is a good champion. Okay. Um, each miss or phase. Uh, so it just helps her build up more prowess. So let's get in here. Have a little fun with Kitty. And like I said, I'm not very good with her. Hopefully I will be getting better. So first thing I, of course, want to do, get them prowesses up, which is very easy to do here. Okay, now she's unblockable. Okay. Great. Okay. Look at that damage. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Look at that. I love running into that like that. Build back up to a uh, 10. It, I'll just end it with a special three just cuz torch him up and there's some other things you can do with kitty little tricks that I will learn a little bit better uh, if you watch when I used her for eternity of pain against dragon man there was a true strike node there and she just cheesed that one I only learned it at the end, of course. But she definitely cheesed that fight. Okay, come on. There we go. Lovely, lovely. Just look at that. Lovely damage right there, too. I'm still learning her. Let's go to a special three. And see if we can, um, she's already at half health. Very nice, very, very nice. I got nervous on that one. So I blocked it. All right, there we go, back. Ah, I wasn't phased. Still did some good damage though. Now I gotta remember to watch the prowesses. Once I have over three, I can try, you know, do them a little intercept thing. There we go. That fight's over. Girl is awesome. And you will see me using her more often. She is uh, a bit risky to play. Now, this fight here, I don't know. That unstoppable mm, can be annoying, but we'll see. Okay. All right. 
right. Yeah, just gotta wait it out. Okay, there we go. Hit him with it. Whoops. He was still uh, unstoppable. And I don't have three prowesses. Yeah, this is the only annoying thing with uh, fighting Juggernaut, just working around that unstoppable. Just makes it take a little bit longer. And firing off the special two, I lose all my prowesses. that there we go nicely ah, I actually hit my special three this is something that happens apparently these days but I hit my special three and he fired his special instead Waited for him to turtle up a little bit. Torch him! Ah! Forgot he was, uh, unstoppable. Okay, there we go. Yeah. A lot of things I have to try to keep track of. I'm looking at his unstoppable. I'm watching her prowess. Just making sure. And when he fires this off a lot, it's just annoying. There we go. Come on. All right, finish it off. All right, that's a good enough uh, showcase. And look at her health. Still doing good, still looking pretty. All right, that's gonna do it guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Bad boy, you better hit that like button. Anyway, take care and you all have a blessed day.